morning and thank you for joining us. Let's start today's technical analysis with the euro dollar pair and the recent events during the markets. Greg? The last session saw the gold gain 0.5% against the dollar. The RSI's positive signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. The euro dollar pair traded sideways in the last session. The ultimate oscillator's negative signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. The pound dollar price remained largely unchanged in the last session. The MACD is giving a negative signal. The Bitcoin dollar pair exploded 2.7% in the last session. The ultimate oscillator is giving a positive signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. Thank you for sharing with us. Now let's hear from our news department. U.S. stocks advanced as market participants looked ahead to this week's slew of mega-cap earnings, economic data and the Federal Reserve's monetary policy meeting. All three major U.S. stock indexes advanced, with the tech-laden Nasdaq enjoying the largest percentage gain. Blockchain security firm PeckShield has published data summarizing the losses to hacks and scams in 2023. According to the company, $2.61 billion was lost in the year excluding multi-chain losses, about 28% down compared to 2022. Amazon and robot vacuum maker iRobot said they would end their plans to merge in the face of opposition from EU and US antitrust regulators. iRobot announced a significant restructuring plan to reduce costs and said it would cut about 31% of its workforce. Thank you, and now let's go through today's major economic events. Japan's large retailer sales will be released at 2350 GMT. Japan's retail trade at 2350 GMT. The French gross domestic product at 0630 GMT. The US JOLTS job openings will be released at 1500 hours GMT. The Eurozone's business climate at 1000 hours GMT. The US consumer confidence at 1500 hours GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join our next review for the latest news and events from the financial markets.